Hey everyone, this is Joe in general, your resident reason and evidence enthusiast. This is a crypto mega mini update, talking about uh, four coins in particular very quickly. First one will be Bitcoin, second one is Sia coin, Scenario AMP, and lastly I want to talk about Recoin, this is an interesting one. But uh, back to Bitcoin, my apologies. Uh, <laughs> my apologies, I've been wanting to talk about Bitcoin uh, for actually quite a while, actually all the way back here uh, when I when it was at five. Uh, this is my uh, order book here. These are, these, are, these are my trades so far. And I, my first purchase was at five. Um, and so I've been buying and selling uh, all the way through here. And I, I have been wanting to talk about it, but I've had other things to do. Um, I'm running a couple of businesses uh, and doing my weekly Bitcoin price analysis. Uh, and I had been mentioning in previous videos that I I would be doing a Bitcoin analysis, I just hadn't gotten to it yet. And actually what happened was last night, I'm actually in Bali at the moment in Indonesia. Check out my previous video as to, you know, uh, a bit more on that. Um, but uh, I w it was about 10.30 at night and my partner was um, asleep and I was up and I saw the price. It was around about here and it was uh, just breaking out of this descending triangle and I actually... Uh, was I actually did a screenshot and was actually going to update this, uh, put this picture up on my Instagram page. I'm actually doing uh, mini updates, mini crypto updates on my Instagram page now. So head over to uh, instagram.com slash Joe in general and I'll be doing sort of mini um, Bitcoin and crypto coin updates on my page, either as screenshots or as uh, little videos. But uh, it was about here, and I thought oh, I'll, I'll quickly take a snapshot and then I'll upload this to Instagram. Uh, but uh, I was starting to fall asleep, and uh, my partner really wanted to, you know, go to sleep properly. So I was just like, oh, I'll just do it tomorrow, um, and you know, see what the price is then. But uh, then I woke up in the morning, uh, this morning, and uh, this is what happened. It certainly did break out of that descending triangle, and we're actually punched all the way up to uh, nearly up to fifty. So. Uh, I said I've got to do a video now very quickly, briefly on Bitcoin. Um, so we have uh, come up to a new high of uh, 49. Now this isn't the all-time high. The all-time high is at around about 179. Uh, it was around about, I can't find it, but you can see here 179. Uh, but this is a new uh, intermediate high of 49 coming up close to 50. Uh, we've got a really large sell wall here at 50 at around about 127, uh, between about 48, 49 and 50, um, over 200 Bitcoin worth. So a big wall to get through. Um, now, where could the price go in the short term? Well, we are coming off this uh, high here of 49 and we are seeing a slight retracement. Now, if the price is going to continue up from here, and not have a consolidation through time, this bottom here of around about 37 is probably where it will uh, bottom out. That's if the price is going to go higher. But if we see a situation like here previously, these number of times here, where it's um, coming down and going to consolidate over time, well then we probably will see a lower price. Um, you're probably looking around about your 30, 31 mark. Um, if you want to play it safe, then maybe put a buy order in at about 33 roughly. That's where I have another small buy order in. Um, I got my sell order triggered here at 49, which was uh, good timing. I actually had that 49 sell order in, um, I think it was actually way back here, and it didn't trigger here at uh, 41, but uh, I just I thought it would get to about that 50 mark. Uh, so I did have that trigger. I still have some Bitcoin up my sleeve, but I've put a buy order in around about 33. That's if the price does come down to this kind of pattern where it will consolidate over time. Um, but if it's going to go higher, it'll probably bottom out here at 33. So that's Bitcoin. Uh, finally got to do a quick video on that. Um, head over to the Polony ex Exchange and, uh, of course, do your own research. Um, but Bitcoin could still have a little ways to go, particularly because of this previous all-time high of uh, 179, as you can see up here. So now on to 
see a coin. This is a, a coin I've been talking about a, a number of times in, in previous standalone videos as well. Um, so I'm liking this little uh, ascension right here, although we're coming up to a point where uh, a decision needs to be made. So as you can see, we've come off this um, high here of about 175. Um, hope you guys have been day trading up and down, but we've got some nice lower, uh, higher lows coming in here. But if you look here, it's, it's got some lower highs as well. So a few lower highs and some higher lows. So it looks like it's forming a bit of a triangle pattern here. So we're coming to a decision point. Are we going to uh, go up high here, breaking 175 and the uh, all-time high of uh, 178, or are we going to uh, come back down? Uh, briefly retrace. So if we're going to retrace key points looking at about 130 around about here and then back down here at about 104, 105. Again, if you want to play it safe then you know pop buy orders in you know a little bit higher and always look at the uh, the buy orders that are actually in play as well. You know of course uh, it takes psycholo psychology into account. Uh, so that's what's happening on Sea coin. Now on to a coin that I haven't talked about before. It's called Scenario AMP. I like the setup of this at the moment, um, so I'll do this really quickly. Um, let's pop out to where it has been previous. And so we have a high here of uh, 43200, and we came uh, all the way back down to a low of 2903. And now, since about uh, the middle of March, We've been in this sort of higher pattern. We've, we've come up to a couple of highs here, around about your 12,000 12, mark. Uh, but we've broken through the 12,000 mark recently, and we've had a high. If I pop in here, we have, we've had a high of uh, 14,832, and we're currently hovering at around about 1,200. And that 1,200 mark, there seems to be a lot of, well, there was a lot of buy orders in here, yeah, around about that 1,200 mark. You've got a number of buy orders there. Um, and you've got a sell wall here of 17 Bitcoin at about 13,500. So if you're looking to, you know, to sort of day trade this, maybe consider putting a buy order in of around about here, about 1,200, uh, 12,000 that is, and then maybe consider putting in a sell order of a little bit before 13,500. That's if you want to day trade, uh, AMP, or, you know, buy and hold, that's up to you, do your own research. But it certainly looks like uh, it's got a ways to go to reach, you know, um, previous highs, a, a, a long way to go. And this looking like a nice little breakout pattern here. So do your own research on AMP, head up to the Poloniex website and check that out for yourself. And talking about day trading, this last coin here called Re Recoin is a really good day trading, um, day trading cryptocurrency. Uh, as you can see, it's quite volatile, and I've been, um, you know, just buying and, and selling these little moves, and some of them actually aren't uh, all that little moves. Overnight, we actually had a big rise uh, from about uh, 3,200 all the way up to uh, over 5,000, but there's some smaller um, uh, up and down moves. Let's look at this one, for example. This is from about 2,600 all the way up to just over 4,000. So nice and volatile coin for day trading. And actually, if you pull out uh, to the longer term as well, it's actually in um, an ascending pattern. So you've got uh, two, you know, like a, um, uh, what's, what am I trying to think? Uh, you've got a um, uh, good bang for your buck. Uh, you've got two advantages here of, of Recoin. The fact that it's in an ascending pattern and also the fact that it's quite volatile in its price, move, price movement so you can do some good day trading as well. So again, check out uh, Re Recoin. It is RIC on uh, the Poloniex website. Uh, so that's uh, a crypto mega mini update. Of course, do your own research. And if you want to stay updated with um, what's going on in prices and if I don't have the time to do a YouTube um, video, I will be doing mini crypto updates, Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. I'll be doing them as Instagram posts on my page, which is Joe in general. So Instagram.com slash Joe in general. And of course, you've got 
uh, my YouTube channel, which is Joe in general. Um, I have had a whole bunch of new subscribers in the last eight days, as I talked about in this uh, video here, a tropical update. Check out that video as well. Thanks very much, guys. Stay safe. Stay informed. Speak soon.